discover the ultimate secret to creating stunning AI-generated videos for free. Whether you're transforming text into captivating visuals or bringing images to life, this open-source tool will revolutionize your content creation journey, ready to unlock unlimited possibilities. Let's get started. Let's talk about the LTX Video Generator, a cutting-edge tool for creating short videos ranging from 2 to 9 seconds. What sets it apart is its incredible speed, making it one of the fastest AI video generation tools available. The best part. You can either install it directly on your system or use its convenient online version. Here, we're showcasing the actual interface of the LTX Video Generator model. The LTX Video Generator model was developed by LTX, but it doesn't have a direct option to create videos within the interface. So, how can you generate unlimited videos as I mentioned earlier? This is possible using the LTX Video Generator's open source tool, available on their GitHub repository. The repository is provided by Lytrix, and I'll include the link in the video description for easy access. When you visit the repository and scroll down, you'll find detailed instructions on how to install the tool on your computer, either locally or through ComfyUI integration. According to the creators, the LTX Video Generator is the first diffusion-based model capable of generating high-quality videos in real time. It produces videos at 24 frames per second with a resolution of 576p and can generate high-resolution videos featuring realistic and diverse content. Here you can see examples of videos created using the LTX Video Generator, and they are quite impressive. For instance, one video depicts a man in a dimly lit room talking on a vintage telephone. The result looks remarkably realistic, and as you can see, the prompt is displayed alongside the video, showing how accurately the model follows the input instructions. Another example features a prison guard unlocking and opening a cell door. This video also demonstrates the tool's ability to produce visually promising and detailed content. Another example generated by the LTX video model features a man in a suit entering a room and speaking to two women. You'll notice that in addition to the main prompt, there is also a detailed prompt for more accuracy. Other examples include a clear, turquoise river flowing through a rocky canyon, a man walking toward a window, looking out, and then turning around, two police officers in dark blue uniforms and matching hats. While all these video clips are visually impressive, it's worth noting that they could be cherry-picked examples. To get a clear picture of the tool's capabilities, we're going to test it ourselves and see the results firsthand. If you want to install the model on your computer locally, you can do that by following the instructions in the GitHub repository. Alternatively, you can use the online version, just as I'm doing. The model is accessible on the Hugging Face Playground under File AI. Simply choose the version of the model you want to use, and you're ready to start generating videos. I'll go with the Hugging Face platform for this demonstration. On the Hugging Face interface for LTX video generation, you'll find two options, a text-to-video generator and an image-to-video generator. Let's begin with the text-to-video generator. First, you need to enter a prompt in the input box. For this demonstration, I'll use a simple prompt, a beautiful lady is on the beach, it's a basic starting point to see how the generator performs. After entering the prompt, you'll have the option to allow the platform to collect usage data to help improve the model. I'll turn this feature on, as it may contribute to refining the tool in the future. Next, there's the Enhance Prompt option. Enabling this allows the AI to add more detail to your prompt for better results. Additionally, you can include a negative prompt to guide the generator away from certain elements. Then, you can choose a resolution preset. A variety of options are available, and the quality of your video will depend on your choice. Higher resolution videos will result in shorter clips, while longer videos require lower quality. For this example, I'll select a moderate value to balance length and quality. Once your basic settings are done, you can set the frame rate. The platform allows a maximum of 30 frames per second for videos. In the advanced options, you can further customize settings like the seed number, inference steps, and guidance scale to refine the output. Once everything is configured, hit the Generate Video button. However, an error occurred initially because the platform requires prompts to be at least 50 characters long. To fix this, I added a few more words, making the prompt a beautiful lady is on the beach she is enjoying Christmas Day with her boyfriend. Without making any further changes, I submitted the prompt again. 
Currently, there is a long queue on Hugging Face due to high traffic, so you might need to wait for your video generation to complete. After waiting, the output video was finally ready. Unfortunately, the result didn't turn out as expected, and the quality was not satisfactory. This time, I'll use a more detailed prompt generated with the help of ChatGPT, building on our original simple idea. After entering the detailed prompt, I'll select a low resolution with a longer video duration to see if it improves the results. Once all the settings are configured, I'll hit the Generate Video button. Here's the output video. Although it successfully generated an 8-second video, the quality is not impressive. The visuals need improvement, which might be due to the low resolution or the complexity of the scene described in the prompt. Next, I'll try a new prompt to generate a scene of a lady cooking in the kitchen on Christmas Day. After entering the prompt, I'll configure the settings and hit the Generate Video button again. Here's the output video. Unfortunately, this result is also underwhelming. While the motion and camera work are decent, the figures and faces are still noticeably distorted. It seems the LTX video model needs further refinement to improve video quality and handle complex prompts effectively. Now let's explore the image to video feature. After switching to the image to video tab, click the upload button to add the image you want to transform into a video. Once the image is uploaded, you'll see an option to enter a prompt. While it's optional, I recommend adding a prompt for better results. After entering your prompt, configure all other settings as needed and hit the generate button. Now, you'll need to wait for the process to complete. Here's the output video. In conclusion, while the LTX video generator shows promise, it still requires significant improvement to compete in the highly competitive AI market. For now, as it's completely free, it's a tool you can try out for fun or experimentation. This has been an unbiased review of this new AI tool. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like and support the channel. Also, in my analysis of Learnify AI, I noticed that 90% of viewers haven't subscribed to the channel yet. If you found this video valuable, please consider subscribing and hitting the bell icon so you don't miss any of our future content. Your support means a lot and helps the channel grow. If you're curious about Midjourney on a budget, I found the best free AI image generator. Click on the video on the left. Or if you're ready to explore Templar AI, the first image to music song generator Suno AI alternative, click on the video on the right. Thank you for joining me on this journey. Happy Learnify AI. Goodbye.